and forced hundreds of students out of Riverview East Academy. Some were also forced out of their homes. And to help those families get back on their feet, many helped to stuff a bus this weekend full of food and supplies. Local Tell's Megan Moore is in the East End right now where students and staff head back to school today. Good morning, Megan. Good morning. You know, it was uh, for two weeks they were forced out of this building because of flooding. So they are very eager to get back into this building today. And I know uh, teachers will start showing up here very shortly. And uh, this parking lot was covered with water for again two weeks. It was still even covered the end of last week. Now it's all cleaned up. Also the stairwell where water got in, that's been cleaned up. Uh, students were reporting to the Jacobs Center for class. They still got work done, but they will be happy to be coming back home. Unfortunately, I'm told many families were also displaced because of flooding, and now they are having to clean their homes up, specifically families in the East End in California. Teachers wanted to help their families, so this weekend they held a fill -a bus fundraiser at Remke Market on Beachmont Avenue. They collected cleaning supplies, personal hygiene items, baby supplies, toilet paper, paper towels, and also some non-perishable food items. I have to tell you that the turnout, I mean, the, the people that shop at this store could not have been any more generous. I mean, it is, we're packing the bus and the bus is getting packed. So hopefully it will help our families. And again, the community was very generous. Yesterday, I was out there as they were stuffing that bus. And uh, again, teachers are going to be here very soon. I'm told about 730, they'll start coming in. And then th those students, about 600 that go here to Riverview East Academy, they will make their way back into this building after 9 o'clock. For now, I'm live in the East End. Megan Moore, Local 12 News. I'll send it back to you. All right, Megan, thank you. Now, you can still help those families get back on their feet. Rivkey on Beachmont is going to leave that bin out near the cash registers where you can donate items all the way through Wednesday.